Hello, Cancer. Welcome to your uh, weekly reading, your impromptu weekly reading for the next seven days, even though it's like the last two days of October. Um, in this reading, we're going to cover what you need to know for the next seven days, what you need to be aware of. Um, we're going to do a quick money message for you, and then we're going to conclude the reading with an oracle card, okay? Um, but let's get started. Cancer, I have an intuitive message. Um, I'm hearing it gets lonely sometimes. So the next seven days might feel a little bit lonely for you. You might be feeling a little bit left out in the cold, um, either by a person or just in general in life. You know, you could be having a hard time coping with something. It just feels like you're feeling a bit lonely, a bit outside of stuff next seven days. Um, it just feels like it's, you know, maybe you're emotionally a little bit down. Um, what does cancer need to know next seven days, spirit? I want to say that even if you're down cancer, keep going. Keep going like don't stop no matter how down you get like just keep showing up for yourself even if nobody else can show up for you the way that you need them to show up for you so that at the end of the day next time you feel down like you know that you could get yourself back up it just feels like right now things are hard like it's hard um what does cancer need to know next seven days what does cancer need to know next seven days the empress i want to say cancer you need to know that you cannot take something on like, um, you need to know your limits. Like, you know, obviously there's, there's something called hustle culture. Like, you know, take, take things all the way to, you can't take it no more. Like, um, push past your limits. That's not what I'm talking about though. I feel like there's a situation here where you may need to set boundaries. Um, you need to know your limits, how much you can take, how much you can deal with versus how much you cannot. It feels like you're putting too much on your plate or you're saying yes to something when you really want to say no. So, um, be honest with yourself. What is this empress? What does um, Cancer need to know next seven days? The Empress. Some of y'all need to slow down. The Empress and the Justice card. This is uh, Libra energy, Libra and Taurus energy. If you guys are worried about a conversation with someone, I want to say don't worry. Like you and this person are going to get to have a deeper conversation about something. You and this person are going to get to talk about matters. Like if this is like a deep conversation or if this could be a legal discussion or what, like getting to the bottom of something. It's something that's on your heart. Like it's weighing on your mind. You know, you're worried about it. Don't worry about that. You're going to have this talk with somebody like, I don't know if it's going to be in your time frame or the next seven days, but um, you're going to have this talk. Like, don't worry about that. You know, you guys are going to get to discuss matters, discuss everything in depth and detail. Like you're going to get your chance to say your part. Um, you're going to get the conversation that you want to have out of, out of somebody. Okay. The Empress and the Justice card. What is this for cancer? What does cancer need to know? next seven days the empress the justice the lovers yeah you guys are going to get to say like your part of the story you're going to get to express yourself cancer um for some of you if you're one if you're anxious about like am i going to be able to get a chance to make something right if there's if there's if there's something that you feel that you need to apologize about you're going to get a chance to say that you're sorry or if there's something about another person like they're going to get a chance to say that they're sorry like that the last time that you guys spoke or the last time that you spoke about it was not the last time. It was just a previous time, but it was not the only time or the only chance you're going to get. You're going to have ample opportunity. So I don't know if you're worried about something. If you're anxious, don't worry. You're fine. The Empress, Justice, the lovers. You will speak to this person again. I don't know if, I don't know if you're worried that something bad is going to happen to somebody or what. Like you're going to, it's going to be fine. You don't have to stress out about it. Okay. Um, what is what else does cancer need to know next seven days damn it i didn't realize my thing fell one second one second cancer sorry i didn't even realize that fell i think it's because um hold on okay it should be good now Sorry, I didn't realize that. One second. Now this is acting up. Sorry. Okay, it should be good now. Feels like the, the angle's messed up. Okay. Should be good. Okay. Sorry. I'm having technical difficulties with my setup. Okay. What else does cancer need to know next seven days? 
What else does Cancer need to know next seven days? Okay, we got the Ten of Swords and we have the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so that's two tens. Ten of Swords. I feel like some of you guys are tired. Like I said, you need to slow down. Some of you guys are tired, so I kind of see you taking a vacation. Like, I see you going out, taking a vacation, doing what you got to do for you because you're exhausted and you're tired. I want to say slow down, Cancer. Like, next seven days, there's no rush to do anything. Like, slow down or you're going to – otherwise, you're going to make a mistake. And I feel like maybe some, some mistake might be costly. Like, you kind of cannot afford to make a mistake here. So, just slow down. Yeah, this could be like – I don't know. I take this card as a mistake sometimes. But um, I see you taking a vacation. If you're not actually going somewhere – you could just be taking a staycation, like a home vacation, or um, just relaxing, like taking some time out and just, you know, taking some time out for yourself. Um, what else does Cancer need to know next seven days? I see that you're going to be filling out an application or a form the next seven days. I don't know. It's, uh, I feel like um, it could be something legal, something contractual. What does Cancer need to know next seven days? Two of Swords. The magician. I feel like you're gonna I feel like you guys are not gonna be feeling like yourself the next seven days. Like you're gonna be feeling outside of yourself a little bit, like maybe outside of your body, outside of your physical body. Like you're gonna be feeling either like somebody else, like someone different, or you're just not gonna be feeling like your usual you. I just feel like something emotional is going on. Maybe maybe you're indecisive. It's like there's there's a moment where you kind of stop and you're like, this isn't me. Like, I don't feel like this. Like, this is not my energy. I feel like you're going to feel, I feel like you're going to feel like something's not normal. What is this for cancer? Uh, where they're not going to feel like themselves next seven days. What do they need to know? Two of swords. Cancer's not going to feel like themselves. Two of swords. I don't know. It's just like, you're not feeling up for it. You're not feeling up for the challenge. You're not feeling up for the work. Like some of you guys may have Taurus in your chart. Cause I keep wanting to call you guys Taurus. Um, or you guys may want to check out Taurus uh, reading or so you, you guys could be dealing with a Taurus. But um, for Taurus, I got the energy that like they were not they were feeling lethargic or they were feeling um, kind of ne uh, negative or pessimistic. And then now they get like the jolt the next seven days to, to get back to work like they're back on their grind. They're back on their stuff. So Taurus just got out of that. So some of you guys, I feel like you guys are going to take the same path. because I don't know why I want to connect your reading to Taurus right now. Some of you guys may be taking the same path and. You know, you're feeling outside of yourself. You're not feeling up for stuff. Maybe you're feeling emotionally groggy, emotionally weighed down, or you're just, you're not feeling like cancer um, this next seven days. And I, I feel like you're going to get out of it, but I don't know. There's, there's, an, there's, there's something to know that you're not going to be feeling like you. Wow. Taurus and the higher font. That's Taurus. Yeah. Why is this that cancer is not going to be feeling like themselves? Why? Next seven days. Why? Seven of Pentacles. Maybe because you feel like something is going nowhere. Why is this that, I said Taurus, why is this that Cancer is not going to be feeling like themselves? I don't know. Some of you guys may be feeling sick. Like you guys may need to take some, uh, some time, like I said, take some time off of work or take some time out. Like I feel like you guys may be getting sick. You guys need to take some uh, medication. Okay. Like maybe go to the doctor. It doesn't feel like a crazy cold, but if you need to go get checked out, then go get checked out. I'm not a doctor. I'm not a health specialist, but this feels like um, you need to drink some tea, you know, eat some soup, chicken noodle soup, whatever kind of soup you like, pumpkin soup. Okay. Um, you guys need to take some time out, take some rest and take, take care of yourself is what it feels like. Get yourself back to, um, like nurse yourself back to health and cancer. You are the nurturer. So nurture yourself. This is like turning it around on you. Some of you guys are just not going to be feeling well. Um, you're going to be feeling maybe overly emotional, overly tired, take a break, do what you got to do and then return back when, when you get the chance to, um, for some of you guys, if you work with a Taurus, this person will, will hold down the fort for you. Like it, everything will be all right. Okay. Um, what is, what does cancer need to be aware of next seven days? Some of you guys may be going on a date. What does cancer need to be aware of next seven days? Okay. We have the high priestess and we have the eight of pentacles. What is this? What does cancer need to be aware of? Next seven days, high priestess, eight of pentacles. What's this high priestess? Some of you guys, I don't know if you're worried, like you're, you're secretly worried that someone could be copying off of you or someone's copying off of your work. Um, I mean, is this, hold on, is this, is this valid? Eight of, eight of Pentacles, the, the 
the high priestess it's like you're concerning yourself i feel like i mean you can't control it unless if you unless if you like patent something or you time you trademark something you can't really control if someone copies you i mean you could you could get legal people involved like the law involved but it feels like you're concerning yourself your, yourself with like stuff that's like distracting or it doesn't really matter i don't know is someone here you may be worried that they're trying to copy off of you i mean are they is somebody like with this high priestess eight of pentacles is somebody trying to copy off a of cancer next seven days high priestess eight of pentacles are they oh okay they could be stealing five of swords knight of pentacles the queen of cups I feel like someone actually is cop. So your suspicion feels accurate. Someone could actually be stealing your work. So in that case, I mean, confront the issue or tell them to stop doing it. I don't know. It's like you may peep something. You may notice something subconsciously like, oh, they, they doing the same thing as me. Or they they taking my, my style. They taking my, my aesthetic or they, they doing what I'm doing. Like, it's just a slow peep of something. I don't know. I feel like that's what you need to be aware of is that you're going to notice that about somebody. Who is this that's doing this to cancer? Who is this next seven days? Seven of Cups of Rose. This is someone that finds you attractive. Somehow I'm hearing Aries. I'm hearing Scorpio as well. Could be Aries or Scorpio. They got like dark features, dark hair. Could be like muscular. It feels like a man, although it doesn't have to be. It could be a woman or a man. Um, what else does Cancer need to be aware of next seven days? Page of Cups. What is this? What does Cancer need to be aware of next seven days? Page of Cups, Two of Cups, Six of Cups. That's the Eight of Cups together. Some of you guys are going to be dealing with a Taurus soon. I feel like you're going to find this person attractive. So I'm seeing some love coming in. What is this? Be aware of. Page of Cups, Two of Cups, Six of Cups. Hold on. No, I don't want to use this deck. I want to use this. What's the Six of Cups? What does Cancer need to be aware of next seven days? There's like, um, hold on. There's like an energy of like you never giving up. Like you're going to be happy that you never gave up on somebody or never gave up on something or someone. Yeah, that you never gave up. Despite like the, the tr like you, you went through the trials and tribulations, you're going to be happy that you never gave up. Something else could be regarding a Pisces. Um. I'm also getting, uh, some of you guys could be revisiting your past. Uh, I'm seeing some of you guys kind of beating up, beating yourself up for like past mistakes, like stuff that happened like way back when. I see you revisiting like old, old, like if you guys are artistic cancer, you guys are revisiting like old works of art that you used to do or old things that you used to do, like maybe like old projects, even if it's not art, if it's like just something that's, that, that has to do with your creativity, you're revisiting some old stuff and I feel like you're taking ideas from the past but also like you're kind of beating yourself up about like past mistakes you've made, stuff that you've done. I want to say there's no use living there in the past. Like you got to move on from that. Um, the past is the past. You cannot take that back. Like that's, that's the one thing that you can't change. Unfortunately, you can impact the present moment. You can impact the future, your future, but the past is something that we cannot take back. We've already lived it. There's no use living there, beating yourself up about it, feeling this could be why you're feeling left out in the cold, actually, because I think I got that for you. Five of, five of Pentacles. There's no use going back to that place, like unless if you're going back there for inspiration. But that's all you should take. Nothing else. No emotional baggage. No nothing. OK, but I see this is a very emotional week for you. Next seven days. What's this? Two of Cups. Um, Cancer needs to be aware of next seven days. Two of Cups. Two of Cups, King of Wands, and the Tower. Some of you guys could be talking to a Scorpio. You may, you may get back in touch with somebody from your past. This person's kind of toxic. I feel like you may find somebody to fool around with, but it feels like it's like a childhood friend or someone from your past. I don't know. It's like the past is being, uh, is being revived again. Or, you know, sorry. The past is being brought back into question. Can I get a money message for cancer next seven days? Sorry, I don't know why. I feel like all of a sudden I felt fine and now, now, now I don't. Um, can I get a money message for cancer next seven days, spirit? Can I get a money message for cancer next seven days? Okay, we got the four of cups and we have the world. Oh, 
okay, you're going to do better without something. Like you're going to be more successful without some kind of something that you're like some kind of clutch that you have. Like you, you think you need it or you're, you feel a little bit dependent on it, but you don't actually need it, which you think you need. Four of Cups, the world. What's the world? Some of you guys, I feel like you're going to be juggling someone in your workplace. I also feel like you're going to be judging someone's work. I see you being critical of like the way someone else makes their money or critical of someone else's ideas. I don't know. You may, you may take inspiration from somebody actually. Like it's, I feel like, I feel like you observe what someone else is doing and you're like, Hmm, I like that. Like that actually works. This could be someone that you were previously judgmental to or a little critical of before, but I, I feel like you're taking inspiration. Like you're taking some bright ideas. So you know, not to say that you're stealing ideas, but to be honest, there's no idea that's original anyways. So it all, it's all derived from something. There's nothing like, you know, so it feels like the natural ebb and flow. What's the four of cups money for cancer next seven days. I, I see you being very nervous, maybe to like approach something new or, or do something new to like jump all in. Some of you guys could be nervous to reach out to someone as well. I do see you getting over yourself, but like, there's nerves there's like an, you're going to be nervous uh initially to do something next seven days you're going to be very nervous clarify this page is page of wands the world this could be a nervous to start something new what's this world card some of you guys this could be a, a first job like you're starting something new um or this could be you started yeah you could be starting a new job or a new project or something like that you're nervous but it's like just first day jitters or something like that it's like just regular jitters regular, regular nerves like You'll be back to normal. Everything will be fine afterward. Like, you'll be okay. What else you got for... Um, I, I, I still see you being concerned that someone's trying to copy you. Um, can I get another money message for Cancer next seven days? Okay, we got the Eight of Wands. I see you getting uh, more clout online or more popularity. So, like, if, if you're trying to... Like, this is, this is an omen, a positive omen. If you guys are trying to build a business where you guys... Um, you guys get clientele, you guys get popularity, you guys get uh, attention. Um, you're going to be doing really well in that department. I see you getting the attention. I see you getting popularity, like something is increasing for you, like kind of rapidly. So if you guys are wanting to be in the limelight, um, this is confirmation for that. If, if, if not, like if this is not you with your own business, the limelight, then this could just be um, if you work for a place, like let's say you go to a place, you work for someone else. Um, you're getting increasingly popular at your job. I don't know. People like more people are talking to you. This is eight of wands for a cancer. Their money next seven days. Eight of wands, cancer and their money. I want to say you're a survivor regarding your goals, cancer. I see you reaching your goals and like you're kind of in a hurry to get there. But you're, you're a survivor. Like for some of y'all, you got yourself out from out from like out of the cold. Like uh, the five of pentacles energy is like feeling left out in the cold, maybe like financial hardship, economic uh, downfall, like all that stuff. It can represent feeling loneliness, feeling outside of something, needing help. I feel like you're a survivor regarding what you do for work. Like you, you, you're rising above something um, and you're completing your goals. You're, you're reaching deadlines. Okay. But it wasn't always this way for you. Like you're, you're getting to the top, you're, you're reaching the top of your game. But once again, it wasn't always this way, but um, I feel like you're a survivor like you 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 withered the storm like you went through a lot uh just to just to come out on top or just to be here and I, I just see you being grateful and i see you accomplishing the eight of pentacles is like your dedication your work all that paying off for you like this could be like more money but either way like if you're looking for a job this is this is employment this is improvement and work situations all that like um your hard work is paying off okay cancer so keep going keep going yeah definitely a survivor okay i feel like you built something from the ground up the eight and the nine of wands. This is like, um, that's the the eight and the ace of wands. That's the nine of wands together, which could be someone like a, a beaten, bruised and battered soldier, like on the field. Okay. Or it could be someone here that's beaten and bruised, vulnerable, like in a very vulnerable spot. Some of you guys caught yourself slipping or some of you guys got yourself from out from underneath that energy and into something new. Like, you know, some of you guys could have literally struggled with homelessness. You got yourself from out from under, out from, out from the cold and into the warmth. Okay. Look at all this heat. Look at all this yellow, all this red, this passion. Okay, so congrats, Cancer, congrats. Um, can I get a can I get a gypsy card for Cancer next seven days? Okay, we got consolation. I see someone filming you, Cancer. So I don't I don't know if like oh there's a cat outside. 
I see somebody filming you, so I don't know if you're working with like film crews or what, but um, I see like, a, I don't know, you could be getting paid for something, consolation. Oh, you hear that cat? I wish I could show you guys, but he's kind of like, or she is going everywhere. There was like two cats screaming like a week ago. Um, can I get an oracle card for cancer next seven days? Can I get an oracle card for cancer? Some of you guys, I'm hearing, uh, if you're wondering like what kind of job you're going to get next, I'm getting something where you answer the phones, like customer service rep or secretary or receptionist, like something where you answer it, like you're, you're kind of on stand, you're kind of on call or standby, like you're, you're answering phones. I'm getting a lot of picking up the phone, like, hello, hi, welcome to blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I'm getting that. Okay. For your oracle message, we have relaxation yeah i was getting that okay hold on let me make this your thumbnail relaxation you guys are taking some time off some time out and it's like it seems like you're still getting like your work is still paying off so it's like maybe you can make like some passive income when you receive this card relax all is well no need to strive or push to get ahead beneath the surface of life everything is gently propelling you in the right direction you can lay down your burdens and simply unwind Slow down and allow calmness to fill you. When you relax and relinquish control, your intuition expands and you create the space for your spirit guardians to help you. Additionally, it's vastly easier to heal and have positive outcomes in life when you are rested and not filled with worry and a need to control outcomes. Lie back, stretch out, and watch magic unfold in your life. Okay, Cancer? So miracles happen when you calm down. I see you taking that break. So don't, don't push yourself this week just just stay calm okay but you're, you're gonna be okay you're gonna be okay you're gonna rise above it and if you have if you're dealing with some sickness you'll be okay okay but then again i'm not a doctor so disclaimer take that with a grain of salt don't sue me but um that's what i got okay that's been your reading cancer i hope this helped you in some way i hope it resonated um if it did i hope it provides you with some clarity in the ensuing days um thank you for watching and i will see you guys in your next reading bye cancer